Got a DC power um, f um, outlet uh, to power on to from current. Here we go. We have one battery on now, and this is what you get. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, turn the button on. Look at that. It is from zero. Hmm. Nothing. <laughs> right, so it looks like it has to be powered by both batteries. Let's try again. Power on. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Stick with the unboxing for now. <laughs> well, what I'm getting wrong. Do they have their own? Okay, it's got the power cord. Okay, so we have uh, this one works. We have this one in here. Let's put that over here. And we have this one over here. Alright. We have the manual. And now we are getting the power cables we have this one which is the power cable this is like the um, 
power connection all right and with that we'll power up this kit unit so uh, two boxes for the two lights and this is for this what else comes in here this must be the sub box two sub boxes this is a lot, it's very compact, a lot more compact than the previous one I had. I mean, this box, this bag looks smaller than the, than the small lights, than the smaller light I did the review not long ago. Actually this one, let me bring it into frame, frame. Okay, it's doing a backlight job there, keeping this side uh, lit. Now, so now they have it compact, it's like a, yeah, but the stands are you know, so portable, they can still extend high enough. So we have two stands, two sub boxes. And, uh, yep. All from this little bag. I think it was well managed. Management. Supposed to be way lot better. See if it has a purple cast. The previous um, one I had, a small one, I made a review. You notice a purple cast, but uh, this this looks clear. This looks clear. Now, what's the deal about the batteries? Plastic, plastic, plastic. This is plastic, but the body looks. Well, hard plastic, well built, a little bit cheap looking, but it does the job. We got the LED light here showing probably the intensity. Let me see. Um, yeah. Oh, we can change it. We can change it to it's double color, so we can change the color temperature. And now we can dial down the. Picture. Although not much uh, explanation was made on the manual, um, but this will help you out if you are getting this gadget. It's a very good and useful one. And here's what's what. Yes, here's what was going on. Um, now you see there is daylight. Five daylight is has five sixty Kelvin, and uh, you're on the regular. And white light is three, um, 200, 3,200 kelvin. And um, of course, this is the power um, DC port. Now, these are the battery points. Um, on this unit, sadly, you have to have two batteries on. And I did try the two batteries and didn't turn on, like you saw in the video. But here's the mistake, two units. This is uh, another of the same battery from GVM. You could use any of this. It doesn't matter, they don't have to be the same size. Now, this is ready to go. Now, here's where the confusion comes in. Uh, there are two switches, power switches here. One on, the middle is neutral. One end, one end of this one is for DC power and the other end is for battery power. So when I kept turning it to one end, it looked like it did not work. So let's try this now. See that? Now it's lighting. But to the other end, it will never come on. If you keep turning it to that end, because that's where that's that's the end your mind is used to turn on, right? This will never um it will never come on because that's supposed to power on only from the DC side but when you have battery on you power on on the other end so you have your light okay so this thing was working fine and um, yeah I've been using it for months now uh, right before I got the Aperture uh, 120D Mark II so um, yeah it's an old video we were just reviewing an old video and uh, i saw some of the clips on on the ground and uh, i thought it might be helpful to some people and uh, we decided to get it out there 
and um, it's, the, it's a very good and useful light. It helped me all this while in the in the studio, and it's gonna it's gonna go back here now. Now I'm gonna be using as a backlight in the studio some somewhere here in place of this other unit that I use in my studio. I'm gonna be using this as a as a backlight. It's time to say goodbye to this light. For those of you who um let's 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 get a, a look let's take a look at the studio right now and the way things are set up and you see yeah pretty much so from now on I'm gonna be well, I'm using mainly one light. Okay, they're still good. They're helpful um, because they are bat battery powered. You can put those smaller batteries in here, which can run from these ones. These batteries, it was my go-to when I'm gonna be mobile and get my shots on. But you have to have the two on before it can work so yep so here we are with the items this is a good time to subscribe um, if you're new to this channel we do music movies and tech reviews um, yeah you might want to join in and stay connected and um, if you're into film or any aspect of film, makeup artist, um, DOPs, uh, set design, set designers, audio, you're into audio, you might want to connect, especially if you have a YouTube channel. We could, we could connect and then see how we can link up. You know, yeah, we have a big dream for um, Hollywood movies someday, but for right now, we're practicing on YouTube. So if you join in, we can all watch each other grow and um, yeah. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and then uh, see you in the next location. Yeah.